Jeff Bezos, best known as the founder, CEO, and president of Amazon, rebuild his record again, even after giving a quarter of the stack of Amazon during the divorce settlement. As per the Bloomberg Billionaires Index, Bezos' wealth reached $171.6 billion by breaking the previous highest one. $167.7 billion listed on 4 September 2018. This happened for the 4.4% hike of the company's share, which now becomes $2,878.20. This year, he alone gains $56.7 billion. Here are 9 mind-blowing facts that show just how wealthy Bezos really is. Of course, a large portion of Bezos' wealth is tied to Amazon stock, not his salary. We previously calculated how much Bezos actually makes in a year, based on the change in his net worth year over year, and found it to be closer to $8.9 million. What's even more impressive is, if you break that down to how much Bezos makes, every day, every hour, and even every second. You'll be shocked to know. That's $149,353 per minute. That means that in just one minute, the Amazon chief makes more than three times what a median US worker makes in a year, and that's $45,552. These numbers were calculated shortly before the Bezos divorce. Well, as a matter of fact, after divorcing McKenzie and giving up 25% of the Amazon stock co-owned by the couple, Bezos still kept his ranking as the richest person in the world. And Mackenzie, on the other hand, is now the third richest woman in the world, after Laurie Laris, Francoise Betancourt Myers, and Walmart heiress, Alice Walton. Mackenzie, who was one of Amazon's first employees, is now worth an estimated $38.9 billion. With his net worth of $171.6 billion, Bezos could theoretically buy more than 30% of the top 100 US college endowments. The top three richest colleges in the U.S., based on the size of their endowments are, Harvard University, with $38.3 billion, the University of Texas System, with $30.89 billion, and Yale University, with $29.35 billion. Jeff Bezos' fortune is greater than those three universities' endowments combined, with more than $72 billion to spare. According to our calculation, Jeff Bezos is so rich that an average American spending $1 is similar to Bezos spending $1.7 million. The median net worth of an average U.S. household is $97,300. Dividing $171 billion by $97,300 comes to about $1.7 million. The Amazon CEO is nearly 38% richer than the British monarchy. The British royal family is worth an estimated $88 billion, according to Forbes. If we compare, Jeff Bezos is worth about the equivalent of the entire GDP of Angola. About half of Angola's $121 billion GDP comes from oil production, which accounts for more than 90% of the country's exports. Bezos' net worth is greater than the GDP of Iceland, Afghanistan, and Costa Rica combined. To be more specific, Iceland's GDP is about $31.6 billion, Afghanistan's is $22.9 billion, and Costa Rica's is $64.8 billion. According to the Social Security Administration, the average American man with a bachelor's degree will earn approximately $2.19 million in his lifetime. And, you will be surprised to know that, Jeff Bezos makes that in just under 15 minutes. He has a bachelor's degree from Princeton University, makes about $149,353 every minute. Though his parents didn't really get the concept at first. They eventually invested about $250,000 in Amazon. Well, I choked on water after reading this in an article. The value today is surprisingly about $30 billion. To buy 10 Teslas, which can cost up to $115,000 each. Jeff Bezos would only have to work 7.69 minutes in a day. Jeff Bezos is the richest person on the planet. Worth an estimated $121 billion, the Amazon CEO is $16 billion richer than the world's next richest person, Bill Gates. Bezos even retained his ranking as the world's richest person, following his divorce from Mackenzie Bezos. After which she kept a 4% stake in Amazon, worth roughly $35.7 billion, making her the third richest woman in the world. Although his annual salary is only $81,840. Most of Bezos' wealth comes from his Amazon shares. The world's richest man makes $2,489 per second, more than twice what the median US worker makes in one week.
Alright guys, this is all we got for today's video, I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe to our channel. Until then stay safe, stay at home. And I'll see you guys very soon in the next video.